everybody, hope you're all well. Today's video is going to be all about Guerlain's 2017 holiday collection. Now, as we move closer to Christmas, a lot of the holiday collections are hitting the shops right now, and I am super, super excited, especially for Guerlain, which I think I, it's a brand that I mention quite a lot on my videos, but I've never actually have done a dedicated brand video, if you know what I mean. So I thought this is the perfect opportunity for me to talk about what we're bringing out for the holiday season because some of the stuff are absolutely amazing. Now, I could not start this video without mentioning Guerlain's Meteorite, which is kind of their hero product or one of its hero products. Guerlain's Meteorite is a finishing powder that you apply with a big brush all over your face as a finishing powder in order to set everything up, but at the same time, it's not a matte powder. It does offer a little bit of a glow, which is ideal. It's available all year round, but every Christmas they do bring out a limited edition package. Uh, which is stunning, it's very festive and I think it's a little bit more expensive than the regular meteorites and I heard somewhere that this year is the 30th year anniversary of Guerlain meteorites and the packaging of this year literally when I saw it took my breath away is this beautiful golden sphere now I have to say there are a lot of people out there that they are collectors and every year they do go out and buy the limited edition packaging by Guerlain and uh, I've heard that they say that this year the packaging is a lot smaller than the typical packaging that they bring out every year. Now I could comment on that because this is the first year that I've actually uh, went out and bought myself a meteorite powder but I have to say if you google pictures of last year's limited edition meteorites powder which was in a stunning blue bottle all the year before which was a, a white one that looked like a stovel this does seem significantly smaller not only in size but in the amount of product there there is in it this one in particular has 20 grams of product whereas i heard that the traditional meteorites that they bring out every year is 25 grams so you do get five grams less than the previous years. As I mentioned earlier, I really, really like this year's packaging. This is very uh, much right up my street. It looks beautiful, it's gold, it has the Guerlain logo in black on the top. I think this will look beautiful in almost every woman's vanity. And um, I'm really happy with it. Now, if I open it up, it doesn't have a mirror that I know that that is another thing that a lot of people comment usually in the holiday limited edition ones they do tend to put a mirror in there this year it doesn't and then you have a puff which is your typical uh, sponge to apply the powder I usually go in with a brush and this is let me show you how the pearls the meteorites look like I don't know whether you can see, these year are very gold and champagne-y. Every year they do change the color of the pearls, so you get a slightly different finish. Gold is my thing and I think to go with the outer packaging they follow the same thing on the inside, so the pearls are all very golden and beautiful. One thing that I do want to mention is that if you shop in Guerlain a lot, you will probably know that, but I have to warn you that the scent on the meteorite is very, very, very strong. Like it's, you know, you open the, the packaging and the whole room smells of violet. Uh, and as I said, violet is a scent that I like, but if you are scent sensitive or if perfume is something that worries you, then do be aware that these are very heavily scented. I wish, and I'm saying that because I personally have rosacea, and if a product is uh, very highly scented, it can break me out sometimes. I do wish that after a couple of uses, the smell will uh, gradually fade away, but I have to warn you, it is very, very strong. It's a beautiful scent. As I said, it smells of violet. All the um, girl and makeup products do smell of violet, but it's a very, very strong scent. 
By the way, I forgot to mention guys that all the products I'm mentioning today I do have on my face. So the Guerlain Meteorite is the powder that I use today to um, finish my makeup off and I hope you can see that it gives a nice glowing a powder. More so I would say than my uh, Laura Mercier translucent powder which I find it sits a little bit more matte on my skin. I think this one um, gives a much more glowy finish which I like. Now Guerlain did bring out also a beautiful eye and cheek palette that was absolutely stunning but I didn't get that one but there are so many products that I want to try from various different brands so I skipped that one although believe me if I could afford it I probably would the next thing I bought from Guerlain is the uh, gold light top coat now again I have it on my eyes today and this is a mini mascara literally it's a gold top coat. So what you do, you apply your mascara as normal and then you go on top with this one and it just gives a nice gold glitter to your eyes and I find this is so fun and so appropriate for the festive season. I mean it just gives you a different kind of look and again as I said I have it on my eyes today and it looks absolutely beautiful and gorgeous. And I have to tell you when I was younger, like a lot younger, I think when I was around 18, uh, one of my friends had this um, gold glittery mascara and I asked her, oh my god, this looks amazing on you, where did you get it from? And she said, oh my god, I got it from Guerlain. Anyway, so I went to my local Sephora back in Athens and I asked to get this mascara and they said, I'm sorry, this is a limited edition mascara, we only brought it out uh, during the Christmas holiday so I was not able to get my hands on it and I was completely devastated and I was kept dreaming of this beautiful golden mascara. I don't know, 15 years down the line and I go to a girl encounter counter and I see again this beautiful gold mascara that they had launched that many years ago. I think it was Guerlain, I'm pretty sure it was Guerlain and I was like oh my god I'm getting this. Just adds a nice festive vibe and yeah I just really really like it. I have it on my eyes today and as I said I know I'm gonna use it a lot throughout the uh, festive season, in parties, you know, you name it, I'm gonna be wearing this mascara and I like the fact that this is not a full length mascara because then it will dry out and it will be a waste of product so a little bit goes a long way. Now the last product that I bought of Guerlain uh, was one of the two limited edition lipsticks that they brought out for the holiday season. They had two uh, shades, one that it was a beautiful red but I didn't get that one just because I have a million and one red lipsticks and I thought Louisa you do not need one more red lipstick. And the other one is this beautiful cherry red that I am just going to show you in a minute. Let's take a moment to all admire the packaging of Guerlain lipsticks. I honestly and truly believe, and I'm not just saying that, I, I honestly believe it, is that Guerlain has one of the most beautiful packagings out there when it comes to lipsticks. And again, every year they bring out the same packaging but in gold instead of silver, which I think it's beautiful and it gives a little bit of more of a festive vibe. I mean, it's quite heavy, but the packaging is so substantial. If you haven't seen one of the Guerlain's lipsticks, they you just pull them like this and they come with a mirror, a double little mirror which I think how cool is that because then it's very easy for you to use that and apply the lipstick. The lipstick in a beautiful creamy formula is again the lipstick I have on my lips today and as I said is this beautiful cherry kind of color and very creamy very moisturizing it's not it's definitely not matte it has a little bit of micro glitter in there which I think again it makes it so festive and so nice again the lipstick has this violet scent but I have to say it's not nearly as strong as the <laughs> the scent on the meteorites so that is everything from me guys I really hope you enjoyed the Guerlain's 2017 holiday collection as much as I did 
As I told you, I haven't bought the uh, palette, the eye and cheek palette that they brought out, but if you have this palette or thinking of buying this palette, please let me know in the comments down below as I'm really thinking and pondering over whether I should get my hands on it before it gets out of stock. So that is everything for me. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Have a lovely, lovely week and I'll see you all next week with another video. Bye, you guys.